Now arriving at Rift Station, Binary Helix Research Facility. Whole new area, guys. Here we go. Now we know that we have survivors here. Also probably a whole crap load of these Rachni things. This could get interesting. Let's see, we've got a lot of elevators on the map. Or on the radar, I should say. That one back there is just the tram, and then we've got two more up here. And then another one way back that way. What are these areas? It's not even telling me. Let's consult the old map, see what we got. Elevator to science station, elevator to hot labs. And then we've got a whole other area up here. This place is kind of big. Restricted access, scientist barracks. Okay, well I guess let's hit up this area first. See what we can figure out. That's an emergency exit only, really. This is the door to the whole freaking area, though. Okay, well, forget that plan, I guess. Okay, so we can go to the hot labs, or we can go to... Where does... Where does this one go? Uh, wherever it goes. <laughs> Kind of really wishing I had gotten that mod for shorter elevator trips now. The thing is, they're not really that long in this section of the game. There's just a lot of them. Whoa. Hey, Captain Ventralis. I come in peace. Stand down. That's right. Sorry, we couldn't be sure what was on the tram. No autopsy, no foul. Can they run a train? Can those things work a train's controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Fair. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot. But I'd like to know who you are. My name's Shepard. I'm a specter. Huh. And I won't look a heavily armed horse in the mouth. The aliens <laughs> overran the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out and he ain't all there anymore. At first we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. So they all got killed, I guess? Yeah, what are they? We've never seen anything like them. What do you know? I'm no xenobiologist. They're fast, vicious, and there's a hell of a lot of them. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday, and we haven't heard from her since. Wait, so that's the whole reason she's here? Weird. Benezia. Is she still over there? I don't know. I don't see what one person can do. A matriarch has the skill to keep herself alive for a long time. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. It can take you down to the hot labs. Oh, and if you need any first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. Does she buy stuff? Because I have a lot of things to sell. Okay, we got a lot of questions for this guy. You're certain the matriarch is still in the hot labs? She hasn't come back here. You came through Central Station, so she ain't there. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from the outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. Yeah, you ain't wrong. Tell me about the structure of the hot labs. It's built into one of the glaciers further down the mountain. Real old, thick, stable one. If something goes wrong, they heat it up and sink into the ice. Normally, the crew gets to the labs using a tram from Central Station. We've got an elevator that connects directly, but it's for emergency use only. Nano, listen. I'm not sending my people down there. It's too dangerous. You understand? Yeah, I get it. Tell me about Rift Station. I can't talk about everything. What do you need to know? Tell me about the defenses here. Secure enough that you shouldn't poke in corners. Tell me more. I just wanted to offer some deployment advice. You're lucky these things are dumb animals. Three coordinated guys could take this place. Have you checked the layout yet? Easily defensible by a few people. That's not counting the automated defenses. Computers can be hacked, that is a true statement. 
Automated defenses can be overridden. What impresses me most is the turrets, alarms, and cameras. They're all routed through a central location out by the quarantine labs. One guy can lock down the whole facility. The security hub's the last logical fallback, and we'd have cover from the turrets all the way. So I should probably disable that stuff, because Benezzi is probably going to be trying to keep me out, right? What kind of research is done here? Beats me. I'm not supposed to know. So long as people don't start dying, it's not my problem. <laughs> okay. What can you tell me about the aliens? Ask Dr. Olar. He's the only one who made it out of the hot labs. He's the only Volus left in here. Oh, he's a Volus. He's one of those Danny DeVito looking dudes. I need to know more about the situation in the hot labs. The facility's off the network. The only way to find out would be to send scouts down the elevator, and I won't send my people to their death. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from the outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. Okay. I don't know why they gave me the option to repeat that. How are your people holding up? We weren't expecting the initial wave. They made it inside. We lost some good people. Those of us left are shorthanded. We've kept order by long shifts and stems. I don't like it, but I don't see an alternative. Long shifts and stems. Why don't I get any stems? I want some stems. Alright, I guess we're done. I've got work to do. Yeah, I hear that. Hell! Man the perimeter! Go, go, go! Let's help these people out! Go, go, go! Where are they coming from? Everybody alive? That's it. Bag him attack. No big deal, right? Thanks for the help. Every few hours a group comes up the tram tunnel. It's actually better since we locked down the elevator. Yeah, it's no problem, buddy. I'll do whatever I can. I don't know why they keep throwing themselves against our defenses. Even animals should learn not to stick their noses where it hurts. Maybe they're being controlled. Maybe it's a hive mind situation. Kind of like the Thorian. What if Benezia is controlling these things, guys? What does she gain from that, though? I don't know, but I'm going to pop another save. Cozy little office set up here. Nothing to do though. Uh oh, more people. What's up, civilization? Two quarantine and barracks. So back there is probably where the defense override is. Six scientists. Don't you point that gun at me, motherfucker. It'll be the last thing you do. Alright, let me check out where I am on the map here. So back here is the guard barracks. Over here is the elevator to the quarantine. Yep. Captain Ventralis's office. I was right, it is an office, but there's nothing there. So why is there a flag there? It's weird. This is the medical bay. Security's up here. Damn, this place is so big. And the elevator to the secure lab. Okay, I think I got it. Oh, and there's going to be a whole other floor, too, if I'm reading that portion right. All right, let's go look in the guard barracks. Loot whatever things they have back here. Because you know they have things, guys. Man, you know this, man. Stiletto 6. Fuck yes, I've been waiting for that. And also a Stinger 6 and a Scimitar 5, but who cares about those? Oh, hold up a second. That thing is mine. Stiletto 6. You know, not a huge upgrade, but an upgrade nonetheless. So, give it. <laughs> and then... I don't know if this is the best usage of this, but I will give Liara the old stiletto. At least for now. There's no reason not to let her have it, like, for right now, you know? These Kesslers suck. I'm getting rid of all these. 
Even the Kessler 7 is like a pile of dog shit compared to everything else I've got. And then let me just double check Garrus. I'm so angry. I th I, maybe it... Maybe this is a classic long couch confuse himself situation, guys. Did I already have the upgraded assault rifle that I thought I had for Garrus? Because I feel like I got a better one than this, but then I lost it. So I don't know whether I should be angry or not. <laughs> oh, I should check my shotgun, too. Yeah, let me, uh, let me look at that real quick. Scimitar 7 compared to the Tornado 6. Sucks balls. Nothing's better. Okay. It's very fortunate that all of these are easy decryption. Edge 6, Katana 6, Equalizer 6. Frozen world, the better. Relax. Turians don't like the cold, Shepard. Did I ever mention that? Once or twice. You're not gonna go to the hot labs, are you? That stain in the corner is where Ellie died. I wanted to ask her out, but I couldn't tell her. What stain? I want to see Ellie's stain, because I'm morbid like that. Maybe he meant it's in the hot labs. Dr. Palin? What? No! Sorry. I haven't had much sleep since the attack. Is there something you need? I'm not sure what I need from you. Holy crap. I'm looking for an Asari. Asari? Well, there's Dr. Rialis over there. There's also our guest, Lady Benezia. Captain Ventralis might know where she is. Oh, okay. What sort of work do you do here? I can't say. I signed a non-disclosure agreement. If we survive, I'd like to keep my job. The location is terrible, but the pay is better than any other commercial lab. You're not happy on Peak 15? The outside world doesn't exist here. Just walls of ice and rock. There's only the work, the discovery. It's easy to forget why science is guided by ethics. Maybe we're paying for that now. That's deep, dude. What do you know about the hot labs? Nothing. I didn't work there. As far as I know, Han Olar was the only survivor. Is he in the medical ward? No, he's staying in the science team's quarters. Be gentle with him. He had a trying experience. I'll try. What do you do here? I'm a toxicologist. I can't talk about my work. Not that I'm doing anything since the accident. The accident? There was an accident here? I can't talk about what happened. Not here. Too public. Talk to Dr. Cohen in the medical ward. He was the project lead. Uh-huh. How are you holding up? It would be petty to complain after showering off a co-worker's brain. Yikes. None of us have had enough sleep since the attack. Of course, not all of us have guns. Okay, thanks for your time, buddy. I'll talk to you later. Remember to report any suspicious noises. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Potosi! Nobody told me we had Elcor up in here. What's this dude doing here? Oh, that's the Dr. Asari that guy mentions? Okay. Let's talk to the Elcor first. Uncertain. I welcome you. Cautiously. I am curious to know what you're doing here. Should we be real, or should we just kind of skirt around the topic, guys? Or should we be vague? I kind of like that. Seems have been caught up in events. Sympathetically. Everyone here could say the same. For now, with forced cheer, I still have a limited supply of equipment to sell. Thank you, God. Let's have a look. Regretfully, most of my stock is being appropriated by Captain Ventralis. Well, maybe it'll have to get reappropriated then. Karpov 8. Ooh, we're getting into 8 now, guys! Okay, first things first, uh, this guy does not have a tool to sell. Or a license to sell, rather. He does have some amps. Let me check out the biotic amp. 
compared to what Liara has. Nope. It would be a very minor upgrade for me and not an upgrade for her at all, so I will ignore that. Um, wait. Okay, yes, I was going to say, can I not sell to this guy? But I can. Okay. So, I'm not going to... Uh, yeah, I think I can sell this. I think I can sell that. Pretty much, like, everything beneath level 5, I think, just needs to go, guys. I hope I'm not making, like, a huge mistake getting rid of some of this stuff. Medium armor for human. No, I think I used that before, and I think I replaced it. A lot of these armor upgrades can definitely go. Omni tool. Maybe I should keep that. I know I can sell that. Oh, you know what? I've got a level 5 Omni tool too. So I will sell that. You know what? We're, we're starting to get into level 8 weapons. I'm going to sell everything level 5 too. I just don't really care that much. I'll keep the Omni tool because I'm not sure when I'm going to want that. Yeah, most of this stuff I'm pretty sure I can part with. Ammo upgrades, get all this shit out of here. Oh my god, guys, look at the money. Look at the money roll in. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. I'm rich as fuck. Okay. Pretty much everything level 5 and under is gone, except for this Omni tool. How much stuff do I have left? Still a fair amount of stuff. I'll tell you what, I know I'm not going to need all of these ammo upgrades. So I'm going to get rid of some of these too. Actually, there's not too many left. That should be good. That should be good. Okay. Now, for buying, I have 862,000 credits. That makes me a happy long couch. Wow, the Karpov 8 is a big upgrade. Even over the stiletto. Karpov is the shit, guys. I'm gonna want a lot of these. I mean, it's a lot of money. But... Give it. Oh, I can only buy one, can I? Yeah, that's too bad. Oh, well. Is this a better sniper for Garrus? It sure is. I'm gonna go ahead and grab that. This is not a better assault rifle. Uh, I can't use heavy armor, I'm aware. Phoenix 6 medium armor? Nope, that would be a massive downgrade for me. Does Liara use light human armor? I can't remember. Nah, that wouldn't be better for her anyway. So who cares? Biotic Amp, nope. I wish I could compare this to what Tali has, but I can't right now, so... Doesn't really look that good anyway. Okay. Guys, I'm so happy. That was very forward thinking of them to put a merchant here in this spot. Lord knows we needed it. Alright, so I get the new pistol. Liara can have my old pistol. And then Garrus has a new sniper. Which is this guy here. Gorgeous. He's missing... Wait a second. Does this have extra slots on it? Huh. I guess when you get a high enough weapon, you get extra upgrade slots. I don't even think I knew that. It's pretty dope, though. Weapon stability? Sure. Dude, do I have extra slots on my pistol now? I do. Holy shit. But I just sold them all. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, I know it's there for when I need it. And you bet your ass I'm popping a brand new save after all that. 
that's awesome. I feel really good. All right, let's talk to the doctor. What? Whoa, Miss Stang over here. Yeah, why don't you calm down? You seem less upset about this situation than the others. That's not what I meant to say. That is one of the virtues of the meditation you interrupted. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I came here and tried to fucking help you get out of this life or death situation. You're a member of the science teams. Recently transferred, yes. What do you do here? Molecular genetics. I specialize in biotic enhanced allele specific hybridization. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's a bit technical for me. I am very good at tracking inherited variations in genetic sequences. I'm sure you would find it quite dull. No, well, you're not wrong about that. Tell me about yourself. I am Molestia Alice from the University of Arraeus. Is there anything in particular you want to know, or should I just spout random facts? Maybe you should shut the fuck up. Maybe that's what you should do. No need to be so rude. You are interrupting my meditations. Precisely how rude must I be to convince you to leave? You know what? Just because of that, I'm never going to stop talking to you. How's that sound? Do you know Matriarch Benezia? Why ask me, and not your friend? Because I do not know anything about the Matriarch. Then why would I? Because you're a completely different fucking person, maybe? What, what even... What is that? Fuck this person. That's all for now. Then I will return to my meditations. Yeah, I hope you fall asleep and die. This is the first Asari I found who's just an asshole. I don't like her. Ugh. Alright, where are we going next, guys? Nope, sorry. This goes to the medical bay. Yeah, this is the different floor I was looking at on the map. Zev Cohen. I know you'd have a cure by now. What are these people so sick from? What? What, what do you want? Were they attacked by the aliens? They're suffering from a toxin. It was an accident. I have a non-disclosure agreement. I shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company. But I can help. But you're going to, because I might be able to help. I'd like to think that the company finds our lives more valuable than their secrets. You know Mira, the VI for Peak 15? She handles the safety protocols for our experiments here. Um, I kind of fixed her. I don't know if it's complete yet. We reactivated her on our way through Central Station. That was you? I'm grateful. Until she came online, the automatic equipment wouldn't work. We lost the connection to Mira in the middle of an experiment and the quarantine failed. These three were exposed to a toxin, something we were working on. Gonna need more than that, bro. I need full cooperation if I'm gonna help. Do you want these people to live? If not, I'll walk out of here. No, wait. It's a bioweapon. Based on an exotic life form discovered on the frontier. They wanted something that could kill the creature. But there was no profit in something that kills one species on the frontier. We kept working on it and adapted it to affect more species. Thoros B is highly infectious, but can't pass from one person to another, like a bio-war attack without a pandemic spread. It doesn't matter how safe you make it. Biological weapons are illegal. Militaries, governments, they'll get this kind of weapon one way or another, and we're trying to limit the damage. I know you can't see that. It doesn't really sound like what you were doing. There's a reason the Citadel Conventions forbid bioweapons, Doctor. I didn't expect you'd understand. Our notes and equipment are locked in the quarantine labs. Captain Ventralis doesn't want to risk more contamination. Is he right to keep people out? No, the toxin has a brief period of viability. After that, it breaks down into simple protein chains. But he won't listen to me. Okay, so I just gotta convince him. I'll talk to him. Maybe I can convince him to let me try. I can't ask you to do this officially, but if you can do anything, I'd appreciate it. What will it take to get the cure for these people? The quarantine labs are near the science team's quarters. Once you're in there, look for our notes. It should just be a matter of following our processes. Okay, I guess that's enough to go on. How's the science team holding up? Better than Ventralis' guards. They've been on alert since the first attack. 
I've been administering stims at their request. But every species needs to sleep. They're getting twitchy, irrational. Yeah, and that's when the bad things happen. Are you the doctor here? I'm a doctor, but not the doctor. My specialty is microbiology, not first aid. We had a medic, Dr. Salah, but he's... We lost him. The automatics can handle basic treatment. Mira runs them. Okay. Talk to you later. I hope you can do something. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. I guess we should also see if Mira has anything new to say. This system is online and ready to provide emergency services. Think you could run that equipment for us? Certainly, Commander. One moment, please. Um... What did I do? Or rather, what is she doing for me? Okay, I guess it was a good thing, whatever we did. This system is online and ready to provide emergency services. Like, if I'm injured, does that just heal me, maybe? What are you doing over here? I administrate the systems of all of the various Peak 15 facilities. What treatments have been attempted? I'm afraid treatment is not possible. An unknown toxin is present within the tissues of each patient. Right. What's wrong with these people? Accessing logs. They were in the midst of an experiment when the shutdown began. When you were taken offline. Without my program to administrate containment procedures, a quarantine breach occurred. Okay. We don't need anything right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. So you're not actually all that helpful to me right now, but that's okay. Right. So we definitely need to get into the quarantine labs. This is the restricted area up here. What's... This just says security area. Captain Ventralis, we gotta go back and talk to him. Okay, so this... Give me a second here, guys. This says quarantine and barracks over here. I thought that was the area that was restricted. But then this up here says restricted area. Maybe they're both restricted? Assault drone? I can talk to it? No, I can't. Why is this game always Warning. lying to me? Watchdog protocol is active. Oh. Uh, okay, so I, I, I gather I shouldn't try to decrypt that right now. <laughs> Restricted area is off limits to all unauthorized personnel. I got it, I got it. Let me see what happens if I try to go in here. This appears to be open. Yeah, they don't have beef with me going up here. Alright. Guess I got my wires crossed at some point. 